What's good guys, it's your girl Keisha Ariel and welcome back to my channel. But if you are new here, please go ahead and hit that subscribe button as well as the notification button so that you would never miss an upload every Sunday at 5 p.m. Okay, so in today's video, I would like to share with you my natural hair care routine over a period of four weeks to show you how I maintain my locks with minimum product buildup. So this video was inspired by some comments I've received in the past concerning the products that I use on my locks. And these comments were advising me to be careful with using shea butter on my locks and another which um, was asking me if I wasn't concerned with product buildup, especially with the wax that I'm using on my hair even though it's a gel wax. But they were saying that wax isn't water soluble and that it will actually stay in my hair and it will never wash out. So with that, I decided to document my hair care routine for a month to show the amount of buildup I usually get with my current hair care routine. So if you want to see how my hair holds up, then let's take it back to the first week of December 2017. So this week was the first week of my second hair growth challenge and as you would have guessed, my first wash day fell within this week. If you're not sure about the best routine for your wash days, be sure to click the link above to help you decide which is the best routine for you to follow for your hair and scalp type. So this is one week after washing my hair and as you can see there is little to no build up so far. You have to remember that build up usually occur with excess use of products. So if you're using a lot of heavy products on your hair, you will definitely experience build up. And that's not to say that even if you do use little um, products that you won't get build up because everybody, even loose naturals, get build up. Also, the gel wax which I use to retwist my hair isn't sitting in my hair and causing any build up. In week three, I'm sharing with you my moisturizing routine. And again, you are very much welcome to check the link above and you could watch that video on how I keep my locks moisturized. Now, I usually like to moisturize my locks once a week. Now this is why I'm not concerned about using shea butter on my hair because as you can see in this clip that I do rub the shea butter in my hands until it become liquid. Then I coat my entire locks with it. And I do this in sections. And here is a close-up of my locks after applying all my products. So you can see that there is no residue of any shea butter being left on my hair or any wax from previously twisting my hair.
So here is my hair three weeks later since washing it at the beginning of the month and as you can see there is hardly any build up. Now I won't say I don't have any build up because no matter how small it may be there's always build up because I do use products on my hair. Now this was another week in which my wash day fell so I went ahead and did a hot oil treatment as the weather was drying out my hair and scalp and then I followed my usual wash day routine as shown in week one. If you're interested to see how I retwist my locks be sure to click the link above and you will be taken to that video. So this is how my hair usually holds up with my hair care routine and I have been following this routine for a little while now and so far I haven't had any issues with excessive build up. Okay, so that's it for today. This is how I maintain my hair and this is what I do on a monthly basis with my hair. So, you know, that just shows that for those who were concerned about the products that I use and the buildup that I may have, at least you can see that this is not the case with me because I'm very um, aware of what I'm doing with my hair. Okay, so I hope you guys enjoyed this video and if you did, please make sure to thumbs up, drop a comment and subscribe if you are not already subscribed. And until next week Sunday, we will be right back here in the kitchen.